Ring of Prosperity Around Bengaluru City, New Circular Rail Network Project Proposed Bengaluru, often referred to as the Silicon Valley of India, is poised for a transformative upgrade to its transportation infrastructure. The city is set to receive a circular rail network, a project estimated to cost 23,000 Indian rupees crore, which aims to significantly enhance connectivity and support the city's rapid development. Announced by Union Minister of State for Railways and Jal Shakti, V. Samana, this project is a testament to the government's commitment to modernizing Bengaluru's infrastructure to meet its growing urban demands. This video provides a comprehensive analysis of the project's technical details, proposed route, additional railway infrastructure improvements, and the broader implications for Bengaluru. Details for this video has been gathered from various news reports of June 30, 2024 and June 29, 2024. Hi friend. Welcome back to SciTech Buzz One channel. We wish to sincerely thank all the new subscribers of this channel. If you haven't as yet subscribed, kindly consider doing so, after watching this video, since it would help us reach our first self-set target of 10,000 subscribers and encourage us to do more. Watch this interesting video until the end so that you will not miss out on all the details. Project Overview Cost and Funding The Circular Rail Network project has an estimated cost of 23,000 Indian rupees crore. This substantial investment will be borne by the central government, which has also requested the state government to assist in land acquisition for the project. This delineation of financial responsibility underscores the collaborative effort required between central and state authorities to bring such a large-scale project to fruition. Network Length and Route The proposed circular rail network will cover a distance of 287 kilometers, strategically connecting several key areas around Bengaluru. The route includes Vadara Halli Devana Halli Malar Hilalich Hajala Solar Nidavanda the network is designed to extend approximately 10 kilometers beyond the suburban railway network currently under construction. This strategic positioning aims to provide comprehensive coverage and enhance connectivity for a broader range of residential, commercial, and industrial zones. Detailed Project Report, DPR The Detailed Project Report, DPR, for this ambitious initiative is currently being prepared. The DPR will include detailed technical specifications, feasibility studies, environmental impact assessments, and an implementation plan. This document is crucial for guiding the project's execution and ensuring that all potential challenges are addressed proactively. Additional Railway Infrastructure Enhancements Rail over bridges, ROBs, and road under bridges, RUBs. In addition to the circular rail network, Significant improvements are planned for the existing railway infrastructure within Bengaluru. The project includes the construction of 93 rail over bridges, ROBs, and road under bridges, RUBs, across Karnataka at a total cost of 1,699 Indian rupees crore. Of these projects, 49 will be co funded by the union and state governments, with the railways contributing 850 Indian rupees crore. This co-funding approach highlights the importance of shared financial responsibility in enhancing critical infrastructure. World-class upgrades to major stations Bengaluru Cantonment and Yeshwantpur railway stations are set to undergo major upgrades to world-class standards. These upgrades are estimated to cost 484 Indian rupees crore and 387 Indian rupees crore, respectively. The projects aim to be completed by 2025 and will focus on enhancing passenger amenities, improving operational efficiency, and upgrading station infrastructure to handle increased traffic volumes. These enhancements are expected to significantly improve the passenger experience and operational efficiency at these key stations. Track Doubling and Quadrupling Projects Several critical track doubling and quadrupling projects are also in progress, aimed at increasing the capacity and reliability of Bengaluru's railway network. These projects include Yeshwantprabhaya Panahali Chanasandra, 25 km this project, costing 314 Indian rupees crore, 
focuses on doubling the tracks to enhance the connectivity between these vital points. Via Panahalihosar, 48 kilometers with a budget of 500 Indian rupees crore, this project also aims to double the tracks, facilitating smoother and more frequent rail services. Whitefield Quadrupling Rail Project, pending since 1998, this project has gained momentum recently. It involves quadrupling the tracks to significantly boost capacity and is estimated to cost 492 Indian rupees crore. The expected completion date is June 2025. These projects are crucial for accommodating the growing demand for rail services and ensuring the network can support the city's future growth. Chronology and Key Announcements June 29, 2024 Union Minister V. Samana announced the central government's plans for the Circular Rail Network project in Bengaluru. During a review meeting with state ministers, MLAs, MLCs, MPs from Bengaluru, and officials from Southwestern Railway, he emphasized the need for state government cooperation in land acquisition for the project. He also detailed the technical aspects and route of the proposed network. June 30, 2024 Further details were provided by Minister Samana regarding the project's scope and financials. He highlighted the government's commitment to enhancing Bengaluru's infrastructure and detailed the additional railway projects aimed at improving connectivity and supporting the city's rapid growth. Strategic Importance and Future Implications Enhancing Urban Connectivity The Circular Rail Network project is designed to significantly enhance urban connectivity in and around Bengaluru. By creating a comprehensive rail system that connects key areas, the project aims to reduce traffic congestion. By offering a reliable and efficient alternative to road transport, the rail network is expected to alleviate traffic congestion, particularly in densely populated and high traffic areas. Improve accessibility. The network will improve access to various parts of the city, making it easier for residents to commute to work, education, and other essential services. Support economic growth, enhanced connectivity will facilitate smoother movement of goods and people, supporting the city's economic activities and attracting further investment. Addressing population growth Bengaluru's population has now crossed 1.40 crore, excluding surrounding villages. The city's rapid growth necessitates significant upgrades to its infrastructure to ensure sustainable development. The circular rail network is strategically planned to accommodate this growth over the next 10 to 15 years. By providing a robust transportation system, the project aims to meet future demand. The rail network is designed to handle increasing passenger volumes, ensuring that the city's infrastructure keeps pace with its expanding population. Promote sustainable development. By encouraging the use of public transport, the project supports sustainable urban development and helps reduce the city's carbon footprint. Enhancing Bengaluru's Global City Status Bengaluru is recognized as a global city, renowned for its tech industry and dynamic urban environment. The Circular Rail Network project aligns with the city's global status by providing world-class infrastructure and facilities. This initiative is expected to Boost Bengaluru's image, the project will enhance the city's reputation as a forward-thinking, modern metropolis with state-of-the-art infrastructure. Attract global investment, improved infrastructure will make Bengaluru more attractive to international businesses and investors, fostering economic growth and innovation. Technical Specifications and Challenges Engineering and Construction the construction of the circular rail network involves complex engineering and logistical challenges. Key technical aspects include Track construction The project involves laying 287 kilometers of new track requiring precise engineering to ensure stability and durability. Bridges and tunnels The network will include several bridges and tunnels to navigate the city's varied terrain. These structures must be designed to withstand environmental stresses and ensure safety. Stations and facilities New stations and facilities will be constructed along the route, incorporating modern design and technology to enhance passenger experience. Land acquisition One of the significant challenges in executing the project is land acquisition. 
the state government's cooperation is crucial in this regard. Ensuring the availability of land in densely populated urban areas can be challenging, requiring careful planning and negotiation with local communities. Environmental Impact The project must also address environmental concerns, including Minimizing disruption, construction activities must minimize disruption to the city's natural environment and existing infrastructure. Sustainable practices, implementing sustainable construction practices, such as using eco-friendly materials and minimizing waste, will be essential to reduce the project's environmental footprint. Timeline and Phases The project is expected to be completed in multiple phases, each with specific milestones and timelines. Key phases include Planning and design, completing the detailed project report, DPR, and finalizing design specifications. Land acquisition and clearances, securing necessary land and obtaining environmental and regulatory clearances. Construction and implementation, executing construction activities, including track laying, station construction, and installation of facilities. Testing and commissioning, conducting thorough testing to ensure safety and operational efficiency before commissioning the network for public use. Conclusion the proposed circular rail network and associated railway infrastructure projects represent a significant investment in Bengaluru's future. By enhancing connectivity, reducing congestion, and supporting economic growth, these initiatives will play a crucial role in the city's ongoing development. As the detailed project report is finalized and the project moves towards implementation, it will be essential for all stakeholders to collaborate effectively to ensure timely and successful completion. This project not only addresses current transportation challenges but also lays the foundation for Bengaluru's sustainable growth and development as a global city. Stay tuned for further developments on these projects. Do let us know your thoughts on the subject in the comments section. My friend, if you have found any value in this video, then kindly click on like button so that it will be recommended to other like-minded viewers and also as an encouragement to create better quality content. Please share this video amongst your family members, friends, and in your social media network so that this information might benefit others. Don't forget to subscribe to SciTech Buzz One channel so that you will not miss out on any of our forthcoming videos. Thank you.